family to feed, so let's get into this tea. I got my honey sauce with me. All right, y'all, we about to get into um, Blueface's story is what we're going to start off with. Not only does he uh, have a couple things on his story, but he's been deleting. He's been deleting stuff. He's been deleting stuff. And um, I don't know why, but we're going to get into it. Y'all done sent me a lot. Video so. and song? Yeah. Hey, we got one. Let's I think go. I reacted to this part yesterday. I did. He was... What? It's what do you say? Nothing. Let's say it again. It's, it's funny. What's funny? Oh, I reacted to this. I, I ain't crazy. To the dog it's still. Okay, he was oh, being oh. a family man yesterday. <laughs> Come on. You ready? Yeah. All right, you got to catch this. Let's go. Let's go. I don't know where he at, where he was at, but it did look like a vibe. All right, so he's saying this old news to the to the child protective service thing. You like mom? So we're gonna get into that. I want to go to um. Let's see who got it. <clears throat> I also want to get into this too, though. It's a lot. It's it's so much. Look at them. They're all up and down. Ugh. Casual day. Casual day with Jamie. All right, so Department of Children, the CPS and Family Services reported reportedly showed up to Blueface's house after coming across a video of Blue asking his son if he was gay while strippers were in another room. This is basically the video where he was saying, um, he said, it's strippers in there and you in here uh, getting Slim Jims and shit. Like, then he asked his son, was he gay? We've already reacted to that. Um, I'm going to read what, what this is on the side. <clears throat> Get in here for this. Y'all remember when Blueface posted videos of him asking asking his son if he was gay while women were stripping in another room where the cops and Department of Children and Family Services caught wind of it and weren't happy about it. According to TMZ, when investigators showed up to Blueface's house, no one answered the door or phone. So DCFS weren't able to assess the situation. For those wondering, yes, Blue, is, Blue still has his son. The Los Angeles County Department of Children and Family Services didn't comment specifically on this case, but did tell TMZ that the safety and well-being of the county's 2 million children and youth is, is its high priority. Also, aside from DCFS call, police have been called to Blue's to blues a staggering nine times since May. Those complaints were for things like loud music and barking dogs. Girl, let me tell y'all something. Blueface is bringing a lot of attention to himself as he's consistently bullying his baby mama number two, okay? Now, he's also including Jaden, which I feel like Jaden be minding her business until he fully... He he keeps taunting with her. Y'all know she don't like Jaden. I mean, Jaden don't like Krishan. She she want to fight, you know? Both of them do, right? And instead of him being a grown ass man and letting these women uh letting these women know we need to do this for the betterment of the baby, he wants to do this for the betterment of entertainment, and that is the problem. So since he wants to continue bringing attention to Krishan, which is giving her light and dimming his. I don't know why he keep asking his son if he gay. It's it's they starting to bring out things about him selling his his son private parts on OnlyFans. If CPS get a hold of that, that's gonna be even worse. You know what I'm saying? So they said CPS been called nine times. Right, but that was for this situation. If they get a hold of them <laughs> pictures, who the hell calling CPS for some dogs, some for some barking dogs and who the that? Right, but they that they sound like a lot. They did say the cops and the police. Uh. Basically, the cops been at his house a lot. Cause it's just too much shit going on at his house. Um, so I just think that he might want to, he might want to shut the fuck up. It's, it's time for you to shut up. Okay. Cause what he think he doing, you're going to lose bro. What he's trying to tell everybody is that me and Jaden are the better parents. He's trying to tell the world, he's trying to convince the world that him and Jaden are the better parents. 
I would put my money on Krishan in seven days <laughs> over Blueface and Jaden. Jaden is a is a um is a pick me. She do whatever he tell her to do. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes with her kids, she will say no. But I feel like when he get to waving some money in her face, all that changes. You know what I'm saying? So that's going on. What you what you think? Ugh. Child, this shit's a fucking mess. I, I say she be minding her business, but do she really? Like, that's how I feel. Mm -hmm. I, I feel like, like, even in in recent stuff, like the interview, like, you want minding your business? You right there in the mix. Like, so you trying to hear everything that's going on besides me coming to pillow talk to you, because I can tell you whatever, whatever the hell I want to tell you. But you sitting right there inside of my interview so you can hear everything that I have to say. So now you know you number two and she's number one. You know what I'm saying? So are you really minding your business? Because it took one thing for her to say, for her to just, you know what I'm saying, say whatever the hell she came out and said. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. It's just, it's a mess. I don't think she minds her business. I think she she's collecting information mm -hmm. to use against both of them, mm -hmm. if you ask me. Okay. Um, <clears throat> I say she be minding her business because she not out here making tweets every day about Krishan. Yes. But I think, can we not argue to say that he drags her in it a lot? Not saying that either. Right. All I'm saying is when, when you're not being drugged in something, where are you? You got something to do with it regardless. Period. So... Then for you to come out and say that she was going, um, she the baby was going to come over there or some shit. Well, he said the baby was going to come over there to Jayla. Yeah, or and then Jada said the room was going to be in the corner, yes. Okay, so come on now. And then the nerve to say that his room was going to be in the corner. My thing is, Blueface, if I were Krishan, like, why the hell would you think on any given day I would let my child come over there with Jaden? Oh, uh, no. Like, are you serious? If if Krishan take all the information <clears throat> between him and Jaden to the court, like her sister said, mm -hmm. she she can uh, I forgot what she aparte or something. Yeah, party of three. Yeah, she can aparte his ass and get him up out the equation because he's such a bad example mm -hmm. on the internet. Mm -hmm. I don't think he's a bad dad. Ex parte. I don't think he's a bad dad, <clears throat> but on the internet, he 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 uses his children for monetary gain. Mm -hmm. And that's what he say that she's doing. But how? First of all, if I carried a child for nine months and I had that child, this is my first experience, blah, blah, blah. Girl, I'm going to do whatever I want to do with mine. Period. Okay. Not only that, he's acting like he's being a real man in this situation, complaining and going to the internet as if we give a fuck, okay? okay. We're not going to be able to get your child. You know what I'm <laughs> Neither saying? Neither are you, but okay. Neither are you the route you're going. But if I was him, I would have been caught a flight. Mm -hmm. Also, he's acting as if she can hop on a plane with that baby, y'all. It's not happening, dude. <laughs> it's not happening. She don't even have to leave. Nope. So I, I do believe that he's stressed out. I do believe he wants to be a part of his child's life, and he has the right. He he played a little part over there, you know what I'm saying, with that child. But, dude, you have lost your damn mind. So now here he come throwing more shade <laughs> on Krishan again in her situation in Baltimore. Nigga is So. Let me express my worries, you guys, because you guys are like, Blue, why are you so worried? She can't take a break. I know Krishan. I know everybody around Krishan, including her godparents. Um, and she had told me that one time when she was in high school, around the time that she had tried on a dress, and that her godfather made a move on her. And ever since then, they've had a sort of a relationship now all right boom it's ironic for him to say that and he keeps 
he keeps insulting his son on the internet. Not only that, his son made an attempt to act as if he was touching himself or showing himself. Okay, Blueface, if you were to go to the judge and say that, and they pull up that video, who y'all think gonna win? We don't have proof of Krishan even saying that, but we also don't have proof of that man doing that. But we got proof of you being on the internet exploiting your son. <laughs> You're not going to win. It don't matter what you say. One thing I believe with Krishan, Krishan, you know, as, as I'm going to say as parents, of course, I'm new to this, but I'm true to this now, bitch. Don't play with me. Things can happen to us. Like you could do whatever you want to me. Cool. But when it come to them kids, Krishan ain't letting nobody touch that child. I promise you, if she ain't grew up nowhere, she grew up in that area. She And grew up in, where we at, about seven days? Oh, her. Eight days. I, I don't know, now. for some reason, when y'all had kids and shit, it seemed like the next day be 30 days. It, my baby, 30 days. <laughs> like, one shit. month, I mean. It feel like it. That's crazy, but she's not letting nothing happen to that child. Nothing. Mm -mm. So all his degrading and his bullying and his manipulation is not going to work. How would I know this? Lisa and Lisa's husband, they will only know if this is true or not. Krishan is that evil? Yeah. The people that helped her whole life, she goes and tells bad stories about them. That's not even evil. So yes, <laughs> I'm very stressed out that my child that's just brought six, yes, my six day old child is left with people that she's claimed to have looked at her or done something towards her inappropriately, right? Okay. These people are not related to her, right? Okay. She probably met these people in fucking high school, right? Okay. We can all see her immediate family is not capable of of anything but yours <laughs> anything, either like, oh my goodness i mean come on bro i know what's going on i don't school you are like you're not better and did you hear his little minion in the back i'm just saying because you could have had some mean. airpods on and been paying attention to your entire phone instead of worrying about what i'm doing on this here internet yeah, she's sitting over there huffing and puffing and agreeing. Ain't nobody got time for you to be agreeing with your little um. See, that's what I don't like. I see. I, I can't. I I can't rock with them because you can't condone in this if you really don't fuck with shit like that. Mm, regardless of the fact, of yeah. if you don't fuck with that woman, you are a mother. You know what I'm saying? And you know that shit ain't right. Whatever I speak to you behind closed doors and pillow talk to you, that should not hit this motherfucking internet. I don't give a fuck. Where we go? Three, How three, three far we go? Like, for real, why would you even do that and put that on the internet? Now, you keeping up the whole mix. Now, you trying to be relevant. You won't clout, huh? Like, this is ridiculous. You think... You I saying all this shit about her family members and all that, cool. You think I'm about to let my baby go to your mama? Like, like come Child, on. Well, my mama ain't no good... <clears throat> But you think your mama better for some reason. All right. My household ain't no good. But you think your household is better for some reason. Girl, and what in the hell? You just it that it ain't. You show everything that go on in your house 24-7. And we see clearly that you smoke weed all day, have a, be high and drunk all day, and have scruples in and out of the house. All Door day. be damn open. Anybody can walk in that motherfucker because it don't give nobody has a key or if anybody locks the door. Let's be real, okay? So who really going to have a child? Not only that, your baby mama does not like me. And you, what you think she gonna do to my child? Are you serious? <laughs> Over it. Yo, that is the wildest shit I've ever heard of in my life, y'all. Over it. Okay, no food in the fucking house. No food in the house. Fucking refrigerator be bare as fuck. Like, 
Dude. Why the fuck is your son even in the goddamn pantry for some Slim Jims? That ain't got shit else up in there. That's all he had. Did y'all check it out? I mean, if they really came up in there and did a wellness check, my nigga, just because you have a running, um, running water and a working refrigerator and a working stove, they gonna look in that refrigerator and see you ain't got no motherfucking food, and they gonna wonder why your child is wearing the same clothes over and over and over. And you got plaques <laughs> everywhere in this motherfucker. You got plaques everywhere in this motherfucker, and that ba- same baby boy be wearing the same shorts, that, same he, socks, he same does. shoes. That baby now, wear granted, the same thing all the time. Granted, kids love that, what they love, okay? And we'll wash it 50 million times just so they can wear it. But my nigga, if you gonna put your child on the internet and you beefing with your other baby mama, y'all trying to make it seem like y'all this good uh, white picket fits family, I think you should probably go to Oshkosh Bagash or something, okay, something and get him a little something to change into. Let's get him Find him a new outfit to be in love with, let's, okay? Let's get him some more class. I can't. I'm over it. <clears throat> CPS, I don't understand because here in Georgia, baby, if you don't answer that dough, guess what? They coming in. That's what I'm saying. That's what I was saying. So this shit don't even, it don't make sense. It don't, it don't even, it don't sound right. I don't know what the hell they got in laws up there, but here in Georgia. That's what I thought. CPS, knock on that dough, baby. If you don't come to that dough. Oh, okay. Oh, you thought? Oh, okay. Oh, that was a cute. bench warrant for your arrest, bitch. That's what like, I for thought. Real. Y'all playing with his lying ass? It ain't him that's lying about that. It's it's everybody else that's saying uh, CPS was there. Oof. He's not saying CPS I'm was there. Just, I'm not saying. It. I'm just saying. He um, said he what what he said was it was old. So did he not confirm it? Uh, he didn't necessarily say the CPS thing was old either. What he else said he that do? was old. So, so TMZ is the one who got the story out, not Blueface. Well, I guess we will figure it out, huh? We, go, we ain't got no choice. Uh, over it. Yeah, I'm trying to get the other, uh, his other stories that he keep deleting and shit. Give I mean, me the fact second. he deleting shit got so, Man. so big of balls to come at a woman on the internet who just had your child six days ago and bash her and make her feel however the hell she feeling right now because she just had a whole oh, human baby. being, okay, that's yours. And you want to make her feel like shit. You got to be the lowest motherfucker I've ever seen. I think he 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 just feels bad. He want his child. That ain't how you express it. See, this is what I'm talking no, about. No, I agree. This is not how you go about it. If anything, your ass need to be cooling it, chilling, you know, being real low. Let her goddamn work that shit out. When she call you, I guarantee you, if you wouldn't have done all this stuff, I guarantee you she would have called. I guarantee you she would have called. She said that the nigga could get the child. That's the thing. Y'all she be said fucking that up he your can... shit. Right. Let me just read these. Asshole. Okay, here it is. Damn. I thought y'all the thing take it forever. All right, so let me see these other stories that this fool done deleted. Okay. All right. Hold on, let me download all these. He's very zesty, friend. He's so zesty. Yeah, nah. I ain't gonna lie, I've never agreed with y'all more with the zesty thing now. <laughs> that zesty shit is very okay. much, very much so real. Hold on, let me save him because this nigga want to delete shit. Um, I I think that he's hurting y'all and he he he's acting out like a damn child. And that's fine. But I would have been flew out to Baltimore. And but you ain't fine. taking no baby, dude. That that still isn't happening. You can fly out all you want to, but you're not taking the baby. Ain't at all. It's not happening. Ain't at all, but he, just like um, what our good friend in the comments said, if you think you would be nice to the mother of your child, if that's you're what to, I'm saying, if you're trying to see your child, I, I mean, know I would have. I got all the power. The uh, hell is you talking about? Real shit. I do not have time. And it's not kidnapping when I got that motherfucking. You ain't on that's the birth certificate. That's what I'm saying. You ain't on the birth certificate. You ain't dog. got no you say ain't about nothing. Nothing. All this shit is just word of mouth. Nothing. You're not on anything. 
Okay? And especially not with a restraining order. It Y'all got me crazy. fucked up. You think you're going to come over here and I got a restraining order on you? You think you're going to come 10 feet <laughs> from my child and I got a restraining order? Oh, hell. All right. So I guess she went and took a picture <laughs> at a um a football game or something. With some guys or something like I, I, what? Whoever football games she was at, she was at a football game. So this is what he was referring to. He is upset at the fact that she wasn't there to watch the baby while she was at this football game, and apparently she was uh, almost three hours away from the location of uh, where she's staying at. I guess Baltimore. This is what he was upset about. Oh, Petey's football game. So he mad about that. Okay. So he's mad that she went to Petey's game. Yeah. And he knows for a fact that she left her son with the godparents. He acting like he know everything for That's a fact. what I'm saying. Because if you don't, my nigga, I need you to hush. Because I'm, I, I mean, that baby could be right in front of her while she's taking that picture. And as you, as that picture, that phone went down, she grabbed that stroller. The hell is wrong with you, dude? He asked her what could be more important. Long as the baby got my blood running through his veins, I'm gonna be on her ass. Bit right. <laughs> ain't even took the hospital band off. Already left the baby with somebody else for JUCO football game. Shake my head. <laughs> and so the fuck what? Like, why do you think uh, women don't deserve a break? Try to tell y'all, shake my head, she can't sit down for one week with my son. Remember, he was going to be complaining <laughs> about the fact that she was going to shows and shit. Remember, that at first, that was the problem. So now, she you tell me she can't go to aunt. a football game? She can't be an active aunt. She can't be an active... Not an aunt, aunt, that's her brother. That's her brother. Oh, she can't be an active sister. See? The fuck? I got me fucked up. Like, dude, what are you talking about? I mean, the shit is just getting worse and worse. My baby not finna be treated like no dog. Me and Jaden got plenty of time to watch him. We be at home with the kids all day. Yeah. Man. Yeah, drunk as fuck with Jaden. Her ass be drunk as drunk hell. Drunk as hell. I don't understand why Slurring he's... Slurring her words and shit. I don't understand. Don't lie. I don't understand why he's acting like he's better or she's better or... Y'all, this shit is wild. I'm not gonna lie. And so what? This has become so mind-boggling. Um, This is so mind-boggling, y'all, that he actually think he's the better parent here. Or... He think that he's going to put his first baby mama who does not like Krishan off on his newborn baby mm -hmm. as if she doesn't have, as if he doesn't have a mother. Oh my God. He I want all that hatred on his baby. Oh man. That's all I'm saying. Cause that, that woman don't even care for Krishan. So why do you think she going to care for your son just because it's your seed? Today, that and you think that? cause I just had a baby. I can't go to a football game. Number that. one. And number two, you think my baby can't be with me? That. Now, granted, her ass need to be in the house now. I I'm, ain't saying I'm she woman. don't. I'm a woman that has been in the house, honey. Each time I got pregnant, I'm in the house for damn near two years, okay? Because I ain't got time for none of the outside stuff. But when you in the entertainment business, sometimes you got to go out and you got to do what you got to do. And in this moment in time, she probably need her little break just so she can go see her uh, brother one time, get some good love, some real love that she needed because you've been bashing her the entire time since she had that baby. Hello. That's all I'm saying. Girl, Girl please, you got me fucked up. I'm about to go out one day and I'm going to be back. I'm going to be back. And I'm a pop a titty in his mouth. That the me. hell? Beer. And if she ain't, I'm sure she's doggone um, pumping. What the fuck? He act like he food. <laughs> okay. That's what I'm saying. That's my whole point. But like Krishan said, you ain't sent me no diapers. Okay. You ain't gave me no money towards this child. And the one who ain't done nothing for the baby since day one is the one who's talking the most. Period. How ironic. Girl, anyway, we done with this video. I just hate the fact that He's acting as if he's the perfect parent, and you're not, bro. 
Nobody would even want their kids around y'all. Nobody would need to ask y'all to babysit some children. Because y'all niggas can't even put the Hennessy down for a minute. Okay. You talk about she can't sit down for a minute. Put that Hennessy down down for a minute. Yeah, she always got a blunt because she got to tone her goddamn anxiety and shit down for your ass. You, I need one now. Yeah. Right. Nigga, but you drive people insane. With a blunt, let's talk about it. Okay. She's coherent. Okay. When she's Hello. drunk, she's not coherent, and you ain't either. Oh, my gosh. So, anyway, okay. we got so many videos to talk about with these two. We're going to go ahead and end this one. Y'all let us know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Shabang.